In 2023, Eric Fry released another annoying stock teaser. This time he was hinting at six stocks, which he referred to as Elon Musk's Project Omega. In the presentation, Fry claimed these six stocks could create new millionaires while plunging others into poverty. As usual, Fry didn't tell his audience the names of these six stocks unless they bought his expensive newsletter. Lucky for you, I figured out which stocks he was talking about, and in this video, I'll reveal all six stocks for free. I'll also share the pros and cons of investing in each company, along with its stock performance in 2024, so you can see how Eric Fry's recommendations ended up performing. Make sure you watch all the way to the end so you don't miss any important information. Before I reveal the stocks, I want to quickly break down the teaser. Basically, the Project Omega that Fry was talking about is just AI, artificial intelligence. He threw in a bunch of stuff about how Project Omega will change the world and mentioned big names like Bill Gates and Bank of America just so his teaser could get more attention and make him more money. Fry believes AI could create $15.7 trillion in new wealth over the coming years. Fry also believes AI will be a bigger disruptor than the internet, claiming that we're just in the beginning stages of AI's adoption rate. Now based on how powerful tools like ChatGPT have already gotten, this definitely seems likely. Overall, Eric Fry recommended six stocks to take advantage of artificial intelligence. Three are well-known companies, and three are smaller in what he calls moonshots. In his report The Top Three Stocks for the AI Revolution, Eric Fry listed the names of the first three stocks he thinks every investor should buy. But before you get excited about the amazing hidden companies Fry discovered, just remember that people like Fry focus more on hype than actual stock research. The first three stocks in this report are companies we're all too familiar with. Fry was talking about Alphabet, the parent company of Google, Intel, and Amazon. Each company is working on its own thing and has a different approach to AI. Let's go over each one in more detail. Alphabet, the parent company of Google, is deeply involved in artificial intelligence across many aspects of its business. One of the most well-known ways Alphabet uses AI is through its search engine, Google Search. AI helps improve the accuracy and relevance of search results, making it easier for users to find the information they need. Google Assistant, the company's virtual assistant, uses AI to understand and respond to voice commands, helping users with tasks like setting reminders, sending messages, and answering questions. Another significant area where Alphabet is making strides in AI is in autonomous vehicles through its subsidiary, Waymo. Waymo uses AI to develop self-driving car technology, aiming to make transportation safer and more accessible. The AI in these vehicles can recognize and react to traffic signals, pedestrians, and other vehicles, navigating complex road conditions without human intervention. Alphabet is also investing heavily in AI research and development. Google AI, the company's research division, works on advancing the field of artificial intelligence through innovative projects. One such project is DeepMind, an AI lab acquired by Alphabet, which focuses on solving complex problems through machine learning. DeepMind's AI has made headlines for its achievements in mastering games like Go and StarCraft II, showcasing the potential of AI in problem-solving. Also, Alphabet uses AI in its advertising platform, Google Ads, to help businesses reach their target audiences more effectively. AI algorithms analyze user behavior and preferences to deliver personalized ads, improving the chances of engagement and conversion. Beyond these applications, Alphabet invests in various AI startups and projects to push the boundaries of what AI can achieve. Through its venture capital arm GV, formerly Google Ventures, and its investment fund Capital G, Alphabet supports innovative AI startups that have the potential to transform industries. Overall, Alphabet is a dominant force in the race toward the futuristic AI that can solve some of humanity's hardest problems. While not quite as involved as Alphabet, Intel is still making major strides in artificial intelligence, one key way Intel contributes to AI is through the development of high-performance processors. Their Exeon processors and specialized chips, like the Intel Nirvana Neural Network Processor, are designed to handle the heavy computations that AI applications require. These processors are vital for data centers, autonomous vehicles, and many other areas where quick and accurate data processing is crucial. Beyond hardware, Intel is also focused on creating software and tools that support AI development. They offer the Intel AI Analytics Toolkit, which helps developers build and optimize AI models more efficiently. This toolkit includes various software solutions that simplify the AI development process, making it easier for researchers and businesses to create effective AI applications. Intel's involvement in AI also includes significant investments in AI startups and research projects.
Through Intel Capital, their investment arm, they support innovative companies and projects that are pushing the boundaries of AI. These investments help drive new developments and applications in AI, ensuring that Intel stays at the cutting edge of technology. By funding these startups, Intel not only fosters innovation, but also brings new AI solutions to market faster. Intel is also dedicated to making AI more accessible and ethical. They support initiatives that promote diversity and inclusion in AI, aiming to ensure that the benefits of AI technology are widely shared. Additionally, Intel is involved in developing ethical AI standards and practices, addressing concerns about privacy, bias, and security in AI systems. So overall, Intel's involvement in AI is comprehensive and multifaceted. They are advancing AI through powerful hardware, supportive software tools, strategic investments, and collaborative research. By focusing on both the development and ethical deployment of AI, Intel is making significant contributions to the field and helping to ensure that AI technology benefits everyone. Now let's talk about none other than Amazon. Amazon is doing a lot more behind the scenes than most people know. If you thought their one-click checkout was impressive, you're in for a real surprise. Amazon is deeply involved in artificial intelligence across many aspects of its business using AI to enhance customer experiences and streamline operations. One of the most visible ways Amazon uses AI is through its voice assistant, Alexa. Alexa powers devices like the Echo, allowing users to control smart home devices, play music, set reminders, and even shop online using voice commands. Alexa's ability to understand and respond to natural language is driven by sophisticated AI algorithms. Another significant area where Amazon applies AI is in its recommendation systems. When you shop on Amazon, the personalized recommendations you see are powered by AI. These systems analyze your browsing and purchase history, along with the behavior of millions of other users, to suggest products you might be interested in. This not only improves your shopping experience but also boosts sales by connecting customers with products they are likely to buy. But beyond their online retail, Amazon makes much more profit per customer through Amazon Web Services. AWS is the company's cloud computing arm and is also a major player in the AI space. AWS offers a range of AI services and tools, such as machine learning platforms, AI-powered analytics, and natural language processing services. These tools enable businesses of all sizes to incorporate AI into their operations without needing extensive expertise in the field. By providing these services, Amazon helps other companies leverage AI to improve their products and services. Ironically, many of Amazon's competitors use AWS to support their own platforms. A great example is Netflix, a direct competitor of Amazon Prime Video that still uses AWS for all their cloud storage and recommendation engine. Amazon is also making substantial investments in AI research and development. They have dedicated research teams working on various AI technologies from advanced robotics for their warehouses to AI-driven logistics that optimize delivery routes. These innovations help Amazon operate more efficiently and stay ahead of competitors. Additionally, Amazon invests in AI startups and collaborates with academic institutions to push the boundaries of AI research. So overall, Amazon's involvement in AI truly can't be overstated. Now, as you can see, all three tech giants are going all in on AI, but what about these smaller stocks that Fry mentioned? What are these three moonshot AI stocks that Eric was teasing in his presentation? Apparently, each of these stocks is much riskier than the three giants I just mentioned, but with increased risk comes a higher potential reward. I'm about to reveal these three stocks in just a few seconds, but first, I want to give you a free gift to help you in the stock market. Click the link in the description and I'll send you an issue of the only stock picking newsletter that I use and recommend. I'm literally giving it away for free, so just click the link in the description and I'll send it right away. The three stocks are STEM, Sabre, and ALS Limited. Let's analyze each one separately, starting with STEM. STEM focuses on developing and managing smart energy storage systems. They use artificial intelligence to make energy use more efficient and cost effective. By integrating AI, STEM helps businesses and utilities store energy during low demand times and use it when demand is high, which reduces costs and improves reliability. They also invest in new AI technologies to enhance their systems and stay ahead in the energy sector. STEM's AI not only optimizes energy storage but also helps in predicting energy needs and managing renewable energy sources like solar power, making it a leader in the field of smart energy solutions. 
Now let's talk about Sabre Corporation. Sabre Corporation is a technology company that provides software and services to the travel industry. They help airlines, hotels, travel agencies, and other travel-related businesses manage reservations, schedules, and customer experiences. Sabre is deeply involved in using artificial intelligence to improve its services. They use AI to predict travel trends, personalize customer experiences, and optimize pricing and availability. Sabre also invests in new AI technologies to stay at the forefront of the industry, ensuring they provide cutting-edge solutions. Through AI, Sabre aims to make travel planning smoother, more efficient, and more enjoyable for everyone involved. And finally, let's look at how ALS Limited is changing the world through AI. ALS Limited is a global company that provides testing, inspection, and certification services across a range of industries, including environmental, food, pharmaceuticals, and minerals. They help businesses ensure their products and operations meet safety and quality standards. ALS Limited uses artificial intelligence to enhance its testing and analysis processes. By integrating AI, they can analyze data more quickly and accurately, leading to better decision-making and faster results for their clients. ALS also invests in new AI technologies to improve its services and stay competitive in the market. Through AI, ALS Limited aims to provide more efficient and reliable testing solutions, helping companies maintain high standards and improve their operations. Now let's take a look at the performance of all six of these stocks since Eric recommended them in 2023. Let's start with Alphabet Inc. As you can see in June of 2023, Alphabet was trading at around $125, and as of August 2024, it's worth just over $161. This represents a 29% gain. Not bad. Now let's look at Intel. In June of 2023, Intel was trading at around $36, and as of August 2024, it's worth just under $20. This represents a 44% loss. So if you invested in Intel last year, you're down a lot of money. On the other hand, in June 2023, Amazon's stock was trading at around $132.21, and as of August 2024, it's worth $162.77. This represents a 21% gain. Now let's see the smaller stocks. In June 2023, STEM was trading at around $6.05 as of August 2024, it's worth 59 cents. This represents a 164% loss. Sabre was trading at around $3.72, but as of August 2024, it's worth $2.88. This represents a 25% loss. Lastly, ALS Limited, which as of July 2023 was trading at around $11.33 Australian dollars. In August 2024, it's worth $14.86. This represents a 27% gain. As you can see, many of Fry's recommendations absolutely tanked. And if you had listened to his advice last year, you would have lost money twice. First, you would have wasted money buying his newsletter just to learn the names of these six stocks. And then, if you invested in these companies, you'd lose even more money. But don't worry, not everyone is like Eric Fry. If you're looking for long-term growth stocks in reliable industries, you should check out the Insider Newsletter. It's my favorite stock picking service because instead of pumping out stock teasers and advertisements, the team dedicates almost all their energy to finding the best stocks for long-term investors. As you can see, the Insider Newsletter has been absolutely crushing the market since starting its service a few years ago. I love how the researchers behind the Insider Newsletter only share valuable stocks that most investors have never even heard of. This gives their subscribers an advantage since they can jump on these investment opportunities for a very low price before everyone else. For example, they recommended buying shares of Linus Rare Earth Limited in June 2017 when it was selling for about one Australian dollar. As of July 2024, the stock is worth over $6.11. This means investors who took their advice back in 2017 earned over 517% in profit. More recently, in March 2022, they recommended an oil services company called Tidewater, which has grown from about $20 to over $87 as of July 2024. So if you took their advice, you would have made over 300% profit in just two years. I want you to experience their newsletter for yourself, so I have something special for you. Click the link in the description and I'll send you one of their past newsletters with five stock picks for free. I'm literally giving it away for free, so click the link in the description and check it out.